There we go. My microphone was muted. This is a problem I have. Uh, thank you, Fragilitis, Fragilitis, for uh, following. We are in Falsiful Palace, doing some quests. Talking to some people. This is what I think. If only the Oracle had turned up a little earlier. If he had, then he could have foreseen the accident that killed the prince and princess and stopped it before it happened. I'm sure the king must be thinking that too. Reality can be a real downer or something. Let's see. Uh, I'll do- oh! Oh, beautiful cat! Oh! So fluffy. Okay. I guess we do another quest in there. We'll just do this one that's out here. These people. In back. Issues with the fortune teller. A man calling himself a fortune teller has appeared in Palace of Palaceful Palace. Something seems off about him. We'll find out what is off with him. Storm. You really are the fortune teller. May I shake your hand? Needs oracles anymore. Fortune tellers rule the roost now. Comes Aldo. Hello, Aldo. A lot of commotion over here. What's going on? Yes, my friends, I am the fortune teller you've all longed to meet. I see the future plain as day. I see where our paths will lead. Lend me your ears and I'll lift the veil and divulge all right here, right now. Fortune teller. Feel a vision coming. A mighty blast will come from behind that very door. In three, two, one. It did occur. Good grief. What in the... An explosion, just like he said. That came from the magic classroom. Hardly call it a mighty blast. This has got to be some kind of trick. Hi, kitty. Behold, my prognostications always come to pass. Listen well, my friends, I have a message from the beyond. I see it. A great disaster approaching our beloved palace. There will be much weeping and gnashing of teeth. But worry not, my friends, salvation is nigh. A second sight will show us the way. Kitty, kitty. Don't put your little kitty butt in front of the screen. All I ask is a humble monetary offering in return. Surely you trust me? You can't put a price on peace of mind. By the elementals. This sounds like a tragedy. How much? How much we must we pay to avert this disaster? Sounds pretty shady to me. This guy is more like a con man than a real fortune teller. That explosion was a little too convenient. I'd better look into this. Stop him from conning people. Guess his quest is over here too. Uh, maybe we'll pick up the other one while we're here. Alright everyone, today we're going to learn how to protect ourselves from monsters. Time to practice some offensive magic. Ready? Yeah! The most important point here is managing your magic output like we learned last week. Watch me now. Ooh. Alright, now you give it a try. Alright. Glowing children. Very good. Marietta, you need to twist your wrist a little more. Abigor, you're twisting a little too much. Make your movements a little more restrained. Good, good. Keep it up, everyone. Practice makes perfect. Yeah. That's weird. Hey, kids, do you know who cast that spell and ran away just now? It was him. I saw him do it. Yeah, well, what about it? It was an accident. Fire, liar, pants on fire. I saw you looking outside when you cast it. What's going on here? Did that phony fortune teller put you up to this? I don't know nothing. He paid me to keep quiet, so you're not getting anything out of me. How much did he pay? I haven't gotten it yet, but oh heck, I wasn't supposed to mention any of this. What were you planning on buying with this money, anyhow? Yes, the cat's out of the bag now. 
Avoided offcuts from monsters on the Karuri High Road. Need them for spells. But everyone says it's too dangerous for kids to go get them alone. They're right. I can't blame you for wanting to buy your components instead. What kind of monster? A Zen. I need Zen tail feathers. Oh, the mango dog monsters. Tail feathers from a Zen, huh? Thanks for being honest with me. Maybe I'll go hunt some monsters. These other... Need Zen tail feathers to use in one of my new spells. Twisting too much? I wasn't trying to. Maybe if I do it like this. The egg. Ab Abigor? Abigor? Ow, ow, ow. Hey, I told you to be careful. Sorry. Twisting too much. Oh, wait, no. I clicked on the wrong person. Oh, I don't want to speak to you again. I just spoke to you. of this conversation. There we go. Humans are only able to perform magic by using power given to them by the four great elementals. The more thanks we give to the elementals, the stronger and more effective our beautiful magic becomes. Goodness. Thunder. Uh, okay. Do it like this, then like that. Give it a twist. It's Marietta. I don't have anything against learning magic, I just find wandering the forest hunting dragons is a, a lot more fun. Problem child in the magic classroom. There's a problem child in the Palisipal Palace magic classroom. Talk to the teacher. We'll probably do these two quests for today. Hello, can I help you? Sorry, am I interrupting? I was wondering if I could sit in for a while. Speakers of knowledge are always welcome. Great, thanks. I've got to say, this class looks pretty comprehensive. It's all about striking the right balance between practice and theory. You might not be so impressed if you saw a student pour too much magic into a spell and collapse. Whoa. Don't you use mana potions or anything? No store-bought potions are allowed here. Students have to make them from scratch. Fortunately, we're running low on our stores of golem crystals, a key ingredient for such elixirs. Really, I'd be happy to go get some more for you. That'd be wonderful. Be eternally grateful. No problem. Time to go kill some golems. They probably don't deserve it, but uh, well, they'll, they'll attack me, so I guess it, it must be done. I didn't want to talk to you. I just wanted to see if there was anything to take. Okay, yep, that's everything down here. Outdoors we go. To the Durissimo Duris, 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 Highway. Also off, I often want to call it a highway, but it is not a highway. That guy to get out of the way. Peek behind him. It's my only character who can stand the slightest of a chance is Tiramis. Not that good at it all by herself. She doesn't even have her later abilities unlocked. Probably golems first, then go to the. I should go there and then come back. That would make sense. Attack! No one can defeat a dragon summoner! No one. Dragons. Could turn their voices off, but they amuse me. So they get to talk. Okay, what am I looking for here? Oh, I gotta kill the mango dog. You're a fool to challenge me. None of those are mango dogs. Uh oh, out of interest. I forgot to I forgot to heal. That's not good. To eat food. Sure, this is kind of loud and concerning. To collect these so I can make some more gear for my people. This way? Search of sparkles. These are cool. Come and on, no more! <laughs> Zen! Fip! 
Tail. Moonsen Tail Feather? How many we need? Probably check. Oh, three. Holy, oh, how convenient. Three tail feathers. These are Zen. Tragic. We have to keep going. Ooh, there's anything down there because there's a monster thing or horror. And I won't be able to kill it, so we'll just avoid it. Ooh, more Zen. Oh, yeah. does not attack. Yes. Very good with the board shark. There's the rest of the uh, tail feathers. Nice. We still want to check for uh, any other. There we go. There's another. Thought there'd be another one. I don't remember where they are. Return. Mm -hmm. Get on your knees and surrender. Slimy Let's keep it up. Nails. Bugs. I'm not really sure what they are, but they scare me. Quite a bit. Quite a bit. Okay, now we need golem crystals. I guess right in front of the palace. Won't run into it. Brace yourself. I accidentally get myself killed because I'm not very good. That would be very important to die. Ow. Yo. So, I'm not really sure what her name is. I think she told me. I forgot. Big golem. Come on, no more. Huh! May not be the most fascinating to wipe all the Podcast. mobs Eliminated. with Terramus, but uh, if I just slowly killed them, I feel like that would be pretty boring as well. It's just a choice. <gasps> a choice between which version of boring I prefer. I prefer the one that goes faster. I didn't think it would storm today, and now it's super windy. Sorry, I'm getting distracted by the weather. Doesn't, uh, I won't hold knock back. my plants down or anything. <laughs> Poor things were kind of sad and wilty earlier today because it was Let's so keep hot. It up. Are all different levels and it bothers me. It bothers me a lot. Wait, why is that a higher level than all though? How did that happen? I don't think that's possible. I think I must just be misreading. I'll defend everyone. Good for you, no. Defend it. I guess I can see this cat every time I go back and forth. Sceneries are very nice. I like these flowers, whatever those are. I won't hold I'm very back. partial to the look of this game. <laughs> I start to play. I think it looks cute. Hostiles eliminated. Art. Nothing spectacular, I guess, but it's something I enjoy. It. Music's really nice. I actually like the way the characters look. Take that. That's not everyone's cup of tea, but I guess it's mine. Let's keep it up. Brace yourselves. Yeah, I should probably yeah. check if we have enough golden crystal. I uh Let's keep it up. I kinda forgot how many I needed. Yeah, Rick is a higher level than Aldo. I don't know how that happened. 
chests. Progress. Okay, need two more. Need to go get some more mana here. Yep. Excuse me. Let me put these. Get on your knees and surrender. Need to fetch some at some point. Oh no, we still got a hundred. <clears throat> we got a bit, a bit to go before we run out of um, MP. No one can defeat a dragon summoner. These are not the most interesting kind of quests where you just run back and forth killing enemies till so you have enough of the item. I guess it's the uh, the MMO experience though. I've enemy. played a lot of uh, World of Warcraft. Well, not a lot compared to most people, but a lot for me. I'll defend everyone. I do enjoy collecting. Probably why I like this game. You get to collect the people. If I've spent too much money on my mobile, mobile me. account, I will probably spend more. Ah, uh, that's not a quest item. That's a, that's a rare drop. Well, I guess uh, whatever gear I need to make from these guys, I'll, I'll have plenty of... um. Materials. You're the fool's challenge. Me. She does not like. She does not yeah. like storms. They're very upset for her. We have to keep going. Hopefully, it doesn't last too long for the, the poor baby. Usually hides under like my computer desk when uh, when there's thunderstorm. I feel bad for her, but there's not really much I can do for her except just make sure she has That's a nice place to hide until it's over. Sometimes she isn't as scared. I thought she would be terrified of fireworks, oh, but she isn't. She uh, She's actually okay with them. Sometimes they upset her a little bit. They're not nearly as bad as she is. She doesn't like thunder and she doesn't like lightning. Like, individually, the lightning flashes scare her for some reason. I mean, I don't like them either. They're, they're disoriented. It's scary. It's understandable. Away again. Oh no, Gollum. This Take that! Gollum in this next one. We're gonna have to go get MP. Or, you know, actually fight the hard way. Probably just fight the hard way. This little round bush. Also, these. Plaz milks! <laughs> Okay, still have a little bit of MP left. Okay. Hostiles eliminated. Before we have to start using, you know, everybody else and actually trying. The way of things. Sometimes you gotta actually try. I am intending to try to do the boss fights with my regular characters, not... I don't know how good she is You're at boss fights. I've never me. used her in a boss fight, but um... Please, please, please drop. Yes, it dropped. Now we can go back inside. Heal up before I forget. I want to try and use like characters, three characters, because then maybe I'll actually get better at the game if I have to. And I, I imagine that would be worth trying to do. I'd like to sleep, please. Need MP. Leaving the cursor on the screen all the time. And MP completely restored. This is a secret recipe of which is known only to the Imperial Chef. Just one bite will be enough to keep you going the rest of the day. Obtained Ultra Jerky. Time to go back to the magic classroom with all my materials. I've acquired through murdering the Wildlife and golems. I don't think golems are wildlife. I don't know why there's so many of them just wandering around. Hello again, Squire. What's up? You remember that material you said you wanted? Well, look what I have here. No way, wow. It's the real thing, alright, and you've got so many of them. These are even better quality than the ones in the marketplace. If I give you these, will you do a little something for me? I can have them? Sure, I'll do anything for you. Wait, what about my deal with the fortune teller? 
That guy's not a real fortune teller. He's a bad man trying to trick people out of their money. You want people to think you're like him? No way. What a rotten snake. Are you going to bring him to justice? Of course, but I'm going to need your help. Ready to put your magic to good use? Uh, let's work on this quest before I get confused and forget which one is which. And uh, not, not understand what's happening. <laughs> that would be a little sad. Just a few more git, my friends, and I will reveal how to avoid disaster and ruin. Hold it. Don't be fooled, everybody. This guy's a through and through faker. How dare you? Eh, a fake, did he say? That's ridiculous. We've already seen his predictions come true. Don't be swayed by the words of this unbeliever, my friends. Trust what you have witnessed with your own eyes. Faith must be unshakable. You won't get through the approaching cataclysm without my aid. How about this? Predict what's going to happen when I finish counting down. This is sacrilege. You dare make a mockery of the occult arts? I won't stand for it. I should do my old person move. Three, two... Ridiculous bluff. Nothing will happen at the end of your puerile countdown. One, zero. Two! Whoa, 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 what was that? What's wrong? Couldn't even predict a little explosion right next to you? Still think I'm making a mockery of your art? How did you arg? You traitorous little brat. You can forget about getting paid. I hate working with children. They're so unreliable. And they're scary. What did he say? Traitor, working with. How could he not see that explosion coming? Maybe he really is a faker. My friends, please listen. Everything he's said has been a web of lies. All of his predictions were set up in advance. Nay, nay, my friends, I speak the truth always. The elementals as my witness. You're skeptical. Not buying it, are you? Give us back our money. Someone summon a constable. This man is a con artist. No, I never saw this coming. Chasing him down. We did it. Yep, he won't be scamming people anymore. Try not to get involved with shady people like that again. I won't. I'll use my magic responsibly from now on. Promise. I mean, he's a child, he'll, he'll probably do responsible things still. Issues with the fortune teller resolved. Time to go back to the magic school and give them the golem crystals. Testing your physical prowess is so pointless. By testing your wits and your magical might, that's a test for more modern individuals. Everyday humdrum kind of magic that you use around the house is everywhere these days. A select group of children has been taken to the palace to learn more difficult and powerful types of magic. With these kids. And they magically disappeared for this cutscene. Teacher, I got you those potion ingredients. Splendid, and not a moment too soon either. Wow, your kids must be practicing hard. Couldn't you have waited until I got back? No problem with the regular students. This boy, on the other hand, is badly in need of an elixir. Erg, used too much magic. Gonna faint. What am I to do with you? I admire your passion, but restraint is a virtue too, you know. Although, if you would hand me the ingredients, I'll whip up something post-haste. Teacher expertly brews a potion and gives it to the worn out boy. Woo, I feel like a million git. Those potions are bitter, but they sure get the job done. You're still recovering. Take a break for a few minutes. No way. I'm finally getting the hang of this spell. I'll get it right next try. Yeah! Stop that. You're not allowed to use spells we haven't covered in class. Too late now, Teach. Time for my new attack's grand debut. Eh, the flow of magic doesn't feel right. Darg. Load himself. Oh no, not again. Whoa. Lightning. Scary. 
don't know if you can hear it, but it's thundering. Oopsie, looks like another failure. What did I do wrong? How many times do I have to tell you? These are dangerous forces we're working with. You need to be more careful. Take some time to think about what you've done and no more magic. <laughs> needs to stop vibrating at me. Shoot, I was so sure I had it right this time. Goes. Boom. I guess he's not as worn out this time. Four eyes. That kid's really something. He has remarkable talent and he's always eager, always eager to learn new things. The only problem is he has no sense of moderation. Wish he would be mindful of how much harm magic can cause if not handled properly. You have a word with him, Aldo. He may pour, pay more attention to the advice from a seasoned warrior. I don't know if I can convince the little guy, but I'll give it a try. Children have reappeared. Time to flee. Flee the children. Now we gotta go talk to them. Goodness, they're everywhere. I want to be free of the children. They are scaring me. Where did I mess up? Mom's spells are a lot harder to use than I thought. Oh, I know. If I release my hold at this point, that could work. I'd better try it out. Wow, you're pretty motivated for a kid who nearly blew up his classroom. It's not necessarily a bad thing, but why are you in such a hurry? You'd cause a lot less explosions if you took your time studying. Not likely. I need to become a great mage ASAP. I've got no time to sit around twiddling my thumbs. A cha Here, he's gonna blow up the palace. Hey, you just got through messing up one spell. Your teacher's gonna be mad. Great mage knows no fear. Stop that right now. What did I tell you before? Uh-oh, looks like I'm busted. I'm the Scarper. Oh, off he goes. It indeed Scarper. Come back. Die. There's one in every class. Little firecracker, isn't he? Feels like it's not just an empty passion driving him on, though. Indeed, I'm worried he may cause irreparable damage if he doesn't learn to pace himself soon. Although, would you help me set it help me set him straight? Sure, having seen what that kid can do, I don't want him hurting himself. I don't want you to think I'm playing favorites with my students, but his late mother was my best friend, you see. I get it. I'll help you out any way I can. Thank you. Feel free to drop by the classroom again. I feel like maybe you don't need to be friends with someone's deceased mother to uh, try and keep them from reckless magic, honestly. <laughs> That kid, Mark, was it? I hope that enthusiasm of his doesn't get him into more trouble. Somehow I have a bad feeling about this. Quest complete! Yay. That's all for today, because the storm is kind of concerning me and I don't like it. We'll go over to this quest marker. I think it might be the next part of the problem child one. Something totally different, though. The fortune telling. I don't know. We will continue this. Don't like that. We will continue this uh, ever, whenever we do. So, uh, goodbye.